Okay, we got the dead bug with the hands on the roller. So for this one, you're gonna feel a lot of core. You should also feel your shoulder rotation improve. So to kind of test mine out in this video, uh, specifically your shoulder internal rotation. So going this way. So I've got my shoulder moved to the floor, the back of it. I'm gonna try to go forward as much as I can. And then about right there, I start feeling some strain on the front side of my shoulder. Usually that's an indicator that the head of your humerus, your arm bone here, is going forward right in the socket and that leads to some discomfort. Um, improving that rotation can eliminate that um, and give you more range of motion. So what you're going to do is you're going to put your hands on the roller, lightly press into the roller, bring your legs off the floor, low backs into the floor. You should feel your abs even just holding this position. It's not going to be a uh, significant amount, but it'll be a little bit of tension there. From there, what you're going to do is you're going to maintain that pressure with your low back into the floor. You're going to inhale as you take your leg out. Forcefully exhale as you come back up. Repeat on the other side. I'm going to do Two on each side to see if we get that effect on the shoulder. Take my hand off the wall, pin my shoulder down to the ground. And now I got some extra rotation and I don't even feel, I got more rotation and I don't feel that discomfort in the front of my arm.